nine months I noticed um she she's not gaining weight. She's not gaining weight and her weight dropped so seriously to six point five at nine months. So and then she was not crawling at that age, even till eleven months she was just trying to sit. So that was the first thing that took me to the hospital. Yes, you know, seeing other kids her age doing things that she was not able to do was very scary and heartbreaking. So that's that was my emotions then thinking what is happening why all this so yeah yeah from nigeria initially i wasn't i i didn't know that i'll be coming to india so because this, the first time i visited hospital they were telling me it is malnutrition that she is suffering from malnutrition but later when i changed the hospital so i realized she's having heart defects so the doctor in nigeria said okay the best option is to go to India and the best hospital to go to is Kims. Yeah, we just want to uh, 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 tell about this baby who uh, uh, who came from Nigeria. Um, this baby had a very complex problem in the heart by birth. It's a it's a cyanotic it's a blue baby. Cyanotic it's called cyanotic complex complex cyanotic congenital heart disease. It's a blue baby syndrome, and the baby had a very complex problem in the sense there is no pulmonary valve for the baby. In in simple terms, the the tube which takes blood from the heart to the lungs it is absent. In, instead, the blood is going to the lungs from the iota and there is a big hole in the heart called a VST. So this baby was referred to us from uh, Nigeria for complete uh, repair for, for surgery. And what we did, we did complete correction for the ba uh, of the heart defect. So the interesting thing is, doing surgery, doing, closing the hole in the heart is, not, is, is routinely performed in many operations. But in this baby, the, the interesting thing was, we used a human valve to connect the baby's heart to the uh, to the lungs because the, the tube is that the tube is absent that human valve came from our own homographed from a uh, homographed valve bank in kims we maintain this human valve bank from our own organ harvesting team in kims when organs are being harvested during harvesting um, during organ donation and the heart is taken out and the valve is uh, the, the the pulmonary valve of the heart is removed and stored in the valve bank that is that can be used for kids like this who don't have the heart valve and the second interesting thing is, this baby's valve is, is should be smaller, but the valve which was taken from a bigger patient, a, a donor, was a, from like an adolescent, an adult. So we have to the, the, that valve had three cut, three. Three, three, three parts, three cups. So we have to cut it down to two. That means we downsize the valve to make it smaller to suit for the baby. So that was the, so because this side, this this small valve of a human type is not available. So that is very interesting. And 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 the baby had a complete benefit from this operation. And we implanted that valve, downsizing it to the, to the baby's size. And 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 the, and the surgery went on very well. And the baby recovered. And, um, and 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 it's very and, and and we are proud to say that this type of valve banking is very difficult to manage in in our country where homographs are not av are available. Homograft is something which is taken from human valve, and and we are very proud that we could do this operation in Kims to save to give a new life for this baby. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, I must I must um, confess the uh, my experience here was. It's a sweet one. It's one. It's one that I cannot forget easily. It's uh, immediately we came here. They received us. Surely, they received us like they've known us somewhere before. And since then, everyone has been so friendly, taking care of us. In fact, I didn't miss home much except for little food that I miss. But India, Kims is a very friendly and a very comfortable place to be. I'm very glad to say she's fine because before her palms, I mean the palms there, her feet and the lips and the gums are blue. But now, even immediately she left the ICU, I noticed her palms is not like mine. 
as in pink and her gums has changed just like mine too so i was so glad and yesterday i checked her weight her weight is 8.9 and on admission her weight was 7.2 so I was so glad, overwhelmed with joy that I know the illness coming. So she's fine.